Hello everyone, and welcome to the stream. Ooh, my camera got tilted up a bit there, didn't it? There we go, don't know how that happened. <clears throat> As you can see, bringing back something to the stream. I haven't played this in a long time. Playing a little uh, Binding of Isaac Rebirth, Afterbirth, all the birth. Give it a wide berth. They update the uh, the game. Really? Oh, it's, I have to put the, don't I? There it is. And we'll update the stream so that it's accurate. And we're going to start with the daily. Because uh, I've been uh, doing the daily every now and then when I've been thinking about it and uh it's been going okay so it turns out it's like a bicycle you, you uh kind of remember what you're doing so let's go back to the let's go to the daily run here looks like we're playing as kane we start with the lucky foot looks like it's just a basic run and we get fart baby it's not actually called fart baby yeah it is called farting baby damn it <laughs> Whenever he catches a tear, he will toot. Um, I believe that knock knocks enemies away and poisons them. A sack is nice. Maybe be able to find a secret. In a, uh, secret room might be next to the to the curse room. Uh, it's tough to say. Well, oh, Ragman on base damage is not fun. Oh. Hey, there he goes. He oh, no, he charms. He charms with his farts. God damn it. Can't let that happen again. I'm allowing myself to get this close because, uh... I'm sure farting baby will do my dirty work. There, poison. Oh, maybe it's a variety of clouds. No, yeah. If you do enough damage to the head before it, uh stops rolling it'll break oh, he's resurrecting some spiders which means we stop focusing on spiders um, I don't necessarily remember what farting baby does because I don't get it very often because it's not very good because not only do you have to catch a tier an enemy tier which is not an easy task you have to do oh I was forgiven look at that I should have waited until after the cursor to pick that up but I just got so excited Magic Mushroom is fantastic. 1.5 times damage multiplier on top of uh, like a 0.3 damage up, tears up, speed up, health up, everything up. So unfortunately that curse room was crap. Spent half a heart for nothing. But that's how curse rooms go. They're a little bit of a gamble. As is everything in this game. So, one of the uh, most important factors in a, um, a in your score, geez, boss already. One of the most important factors in a score is damage penalty on the daily run, which oh god, they stack up quite a bit. Uh, we don't want to fight the boss yet. I'd like to find the item room first. We cannot get hit. Um, at this time, if we get hit, it's, it is a disaster. Um, we need, or hopefully gonna get, uh, no, I'm not rolling. You can't make me roll magic mush. Can't do it. Um, I think there's an okay chance of a secret room here. <sighs> All right, let's hope it's not the haunt. Hey, it's Monstro. It's Monstro in a slightly abbreviated room, which sucks. Jeez, somebody is uh, really showing off their car speakers outside. And the fact that they won't have any hearing in their 30s. So we don't want to get damaged here because we want to get that sweet, sweet deal with the devil. Oh, that was very close. And we did it. Hey, two picks are good. Tears and shot speed. Shot speed's good. Oh, 
I don't want to take that, but I'm going to because I don't have a space bar item. It's a book, so it'll open up libraries uh, to us. And three, it'll guarantee deals with the devil. We don't run the risk of getting deals with the angel. And uh, I feel like we're we are strong enough where we don't have to necessarily rely on our first deal with the devil to carry us, which is how a lot of runs go. So. All right, well, we're just going to crack the uh, Necronomicon. No, we're not. We're not going to do that. I'm going to take a peek at the curse room. Hey, this could be good. A rune and a card. A rune could be something magical. Check the card first. The moon. Hey, we could... Uh, the moon will get us out of here. Thanks. Thanks a lot. <laughs> so there's a shop. We don't have any money or keys, so we ain't going there. Um, but at least we got the resistance room. Resistance room gives us a 30 second invulnerability shield. I think people are people are setting off their leftover fireworks. For brown chest, we are not going to fight that room unless we get like severely overpowered in the next. Uh, moment or so actually with let's do it because we have the um yeah, let's pop those with that let's say we could use the uh the necronomicon so the reason the necronomicon being a book is important is after you've touched a book your chance at getting a library is severely increased this is that was two keys. Very nice. This is nowhere near as important as it was in Wrath of the Lamb as the library pool is way bigger and libraries are not guaranteed to have um, have book pedestals in them. But, ooh, that's, we're going to talk about that in a minute. Uh, Undefined teleports us and it can teleport us to an I Am Era room. Which can give us oh, fuck this room. <laughs> if there's ever a room to use the Necronomicon on, it's a it's a two by two room full of enemies that it will kill. Um, oh, this room is very rare. I don't know why, but it's very rare. But um, the flip side is that. You could also get a a library with like five book pedestals in it, and so if you get like re-rolling in there, um, you can make a lot of a lot of crazy stuff happen. Let's uh, I think just blowing up any one of these will, will do it. There we go. Oh, same there. I actually, I've never seen this room. I don't think, which is odd because I have like 500 hours of playing this game. And I don't recall this room. That was very close. Yeah, let's go. I don't think this place summons anything. I'll just crack the Necronomic Necronomicon when we're dodging for our lives here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Hey, we did it. Eh, we'll take him. Uh, all right, I'm gonna go back and grab undefined. Still don't have enough money to make the shop worthwhile, so we're gonna ignore it. Um, oh, also we have to go to that that curse room still. I think you know what? Let's we'll use the undefined in the curse room. So there's a couple of rooms that can. Uh, Hey, full health. Very nice to know it's in the rotation. There's a couple of rooms that it can teleport us to. Sweet. Uh, luck up. Luck. That's fine. Hey, the second secret room is one of them. So, luck up. Luck up. Uh, these we grab before full health. Range. Range down. That's unfortunate. Pretty fly is pretty good. Alright, whatever. So, if it teleports, the I am air rooms can be amazing. So, I don't want to use undefined on cooldown. 
but I do want to use it before I leave a floor. Open up, please. There we go. <clears throat> Because I don't miss out on anything by get by going there. Um, I can by going there with the things I'm still on the floor. I get stuck in the I am air room, be forced to go down to the next floor, which I may not want to do. Actually, we're gonna go up here and go to the right. Yeah, that was very close. Caught shot by Steven. Put him away. Thankfully from that magic much, we have a nice little speed up. Now one thing I noticed since I've been playing this game in a while is I have been missing tinted rocks. <laughs> so hopefully I haven't missed any tinted rocks yet. They're, they're fairly common as far as things in this game go, but I haven't seen any yet. Alright, let's fight the boss. Good chance at a deal here. The frail. Alright, popped him at a pretty good time. Oop. Oh yeah, I forgot to use blasts a whole bunch. Now it's over. Uh, speedball? Speedball's alright. More speed, more shot speed. Right into Krampus. Which is unfortunate. You have to fight Krampus eventually. It happens almost every run. Alright, just... Oh, I walked into that. That's my fault. We got the lump. Lump of coal is fine. Increases our damage. Uh... The farther our shots have traveled, you watch them grow as they go across the screen because their their damage is ramping up. So it's going to incentivize us to stay away from enemies, as if we weren't already incentivized enough. So yeah, whenever you take a uh, deal with the devil, uh, you have a thirty percent chance on subsequent deal with the devils. God damn it! <laughs> to get, uh, to fight Krampus. Um, if you have, uh, if you've taken something, if you've, you've purchased something, you've traded health for something in a previous deal. Um, if you have not traded hearts for something, I believe it remains at 10%, so I go to your first subsequent. Ooh, Dead Sea Scrolls are not very good. So... I will ignore them. Dead Sea Scrolls use a random spacebar item whenever you use them. Uh, you know what? We can check out the shop. Which may not be a bad idea. Let's see if we can... Nope. Uh, you know what? It is right here, huh? There it is. Two keys, and we'll use a bomb to get to the shop instead of a key. Uh, we're gonna buy the spirit heart and oh, lose it immediately on some spikes. Ah, uh, I'm so good at this game. I'm gonna blame my uh, abnormally high speed. Well, I've. Screwed up that bomb placement, but it turns out it's okay. Hey, the I am air room. Where there are two bosses. And the cursed eye. Guess what I'm not taking. I don't know if killing these... I don't think killing these guys will get me anything, but... Oh, it got me a key. Um, blow up by a mirror guy? Uh, they're just... We're not taking curse eye. <laughs> that's, that's not a thing we're about to do. So, undefined, um, if you are not aware, uh, 
is actually from Wrath of the Lamb, but it wasn't a real item. It was what happened when you emptied out all the item pools and the game tried to generate an item. It'd create this pedestal that would just cycle through all the item icons very quickly, like one a frame. Um, no luck up, I'll take it. And uh, when you picked it up, it would just say undefined. So, <clears throat> Very common to encounter that on uh, breaking runs, especially... Ooh, that's... Magicians. Not very good. Homing tears for a room is nothing... Is not much compared to 30 seconds of invulnerability. That we'll probably be using on some very scary boss in the future. Um, yeah, we're going to take Hive Mind. Hive Mind just one of those things that you take. Because if you become Guppy and you miss the Hive Mind, you're going to be saved. We're depths one or two. Ooh, we have to... We're running behind schedule here. God damn it. We, uh, we want to get the boss rush, which means you have to beat Mom before the 20 minute mark. Oh. So, let's not dawdle. Get a, uh, a nice big score bonus for beating boss rushes. Not to mention, you know, a uh, free item. Do need that money. Alright, we have to cross the other bringer. We'll go for the nickel, but... Forget about the penny. Another great room to use, uh... The Necronomicon on, if I still had it. But I don't, so... More, yeah. So let's just roll on. God damn it, wrong way. I'd like to get out of this floor, like now-ish, but black heart. All right, at least you made it kind of worth my time. Room. Love that box. Yeah, perfect. Actually, I should bump into that red heart to see if I've taken red heart damage on this floor. Good. I have not. Hey, Lucer. Our item room is right next to our uh, to our boss fight, so we get that. This thing's gonna explode into a circle of tears. Yeah, I'll take spectral tears. Why not? No real reason not to. Loki in a tiny room. That can be annoying. Let's pull that quickly. Any boss in a tiny room can be annoying. But thankfully. I dealt them pretty well. Bomb explode. Thank you very much. Yeah, we're taking Abaddon. And we got sent to the secret room, which gave us infamy, which is fine. But now we got a motor. Actually, we can grab this battery and try again. Hey, it took us to the item room. And we're down. Okay, we're only like a minute behind where I want to be. This has to be something amazing. That is not amazing. We're drawing like three guppy items. So, Abaddon takes all your red hearts away. Gives you six black hearts in exchange. Doesn't take any of your hearts. Ooh, let's just do this now. Joker. I think there's a luck up in here. And yeah, you're a luck up. What makes you larger? Bad yeah. gas. Ouch. Addicted doesn't really mean anything. The Hermit. Now nah, we gotta keep the rune here. So it also gives you a 1.5 damage up and gives your tears a uh, chance to fear. A pretty good chance to fear, actually. You'll see it happening a lot. Oh, Spectral Tears almost screwed me. Alright, so we found our mom fight, which is super important because now we can explore a little bit. And, uh, still hopefully get back there in time. And 
two bombs is not worth. Come on, make it. We did it. And I said, good thing our speed is very high, so. Oh, yeah, Spectral Tears. <laughs> Leo, we're going to roll that. We have a, a moment. Ugh, terrible. I'm going to roll with money. No. No. All right, now we'll roll with bombs. No. You know what? We'll take scapular. Oh, it's too soon. Execute us too soon. Let's explore a little bit just because we can. Yep, that ex exploration bonus a touch. Oh, that's dumb. Another curse of the unknown. Can't see our health. Um, we already went to our deal with the devil, however. Alright. Uh, let's just go fight mom. I think we're in a good position here. Is this the, uh, the secret room? It is. That is enough money to go to the shop, that's for sure. Oops. So, uh, let's do that right before our mom fight. Uh, the battery or the map? I'll just take the map. How much is over there? Nah, we're not gonna, we're not gonna bother. Just in case things go horribly wrong with this mom fight. Although they should. Our damage isn't blowing the doors off, but it's okay. Damn it. Oh, that'll help. Damage a bunch of parts simultaneously. Take the Polaroid here, so it doesn't matter. There's a tinted rock with those things I said I missed a bunch. We got it. Had a couple of bombs. Ooh. These are not very good. Mongo Baby. Seraphim. Is that Bumbo? Or Key Bum? I think I'm going to take Seraphim. Just because it fires the highest damage tiers. Jeez. Quite a lot of ragmen. So we could warp out of here. Um, with our ill-gotten gains of one item. But then we wouldn't get credit for completing the boss rush. So we're not going to do that. <laughs> we gotta say the job is done. Oh, it's the carry-on queen that um, that doesn't poop. She poops little hearts. Hearts I can break. Also, she runs into spikes very nicely. Fear is great on these charging bosses. If you can get it to affect them. There it is. Alright, this is gonna explode into bombs. I was really hoping for some type of piercing or um, you know, guppy bits because guppy's the crazy OP. So work on taking out pestilence. All these, uh, these haunts. Oh shit. Oh yeah, we don't have any red hearts so every time we get hit we're going to get this this invulnerability shield for five seconds. It's pretty sweet. Uh, God, I don't remember the name of this boss. It's not Polycephalus. It's like the champion version of Polycephalus. Angel wants to be above... The blue angel wants to be above you, so go to the top and it gets real upset. It's uh, Ariel, the angel with the red sash, is Gabriel. Ooh, double the cage with champion the bloat. All right, we're fighting the bloat first. <laughs> God, I kind of want to go in front of the bloat and bait him into laser eyeing, but that's a risky play, Cotton.
Alright, not too bad, all things considered. We want to get... We want to get Poop Boy done first here. We get his follow-up Dingle. Now, um... The Wretched. Ouch! Well, worked out that time. I'm fighting the bloat again. I guess the other one was Pete. The other one was Pete. So we got Champion Pete and Champion Bloat. I forgot that the, uh, uh, this is probably a pin someplace here. Or a frail. Whichever. Whoa! Tail popping up isn't as bad. Dark one or there's the fallen. Hard to keep all these boss names straight. I'm also a Loki. There's that bendy brim. Sweet. Oh, that's my bad. Let's get in here. Push him. Okay, if you bring bring a little bit there and bring it up, kill the gate, <laughs> kill your friend. Ah, oh, speaking of Gabriel, here he is. Gabriel doesn't care so much about being above you. He like he cares a little, but nowhere near as much. Jesus, this is. He also apparently doesn't care about fear. Fear is the mind killer. All right, there we go. Can't have too many rounds of this. It's 15 waves of two bosses at a time. So nice, he blew himself up there because he just rode the wave. Oh. Come here, buddy. In, um... In Rebirth, you can tell how far... Oh, I might stand in... Some nice brick between the two of us. Um... Shit. Oh, he's the, he's the one dash guy. Um... But you can tell how far along you were, because the boss... You always fought the bosses in the same order. One thing Edward Millen uh, disliked is knowing things beforehand in this game. He wanted as much stuff random as possible. He um, he thinks uh, he's of the opinion that having the set bosses of hey we did it hey I'll take Serpent's Kiss that's not bad we did it with five minutes to spare woo um, to get to the hush fight. Somebody playing not Gungeon. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Lando. We got room one here. I don't even... I mean, left? It's got to be left. Oh, geez, we just have to jet to make the hush. But, um... He feels that one of the... Weak design points of the game is that you have to fight Mom every run. You have to fight Mom's heart every run. He much preferred... Oh, I didn't, um... I didn't what you call it. Uh, that takes a full heart, so we might do that after. I guess we're going... Let's try up. Nope. Right, good thing we killed that guy. He was about to come up, and then kill him again would cause him to split again into two more, um... I forget what they're called. Uh, whenever poison kills something, there's a chance it'll drop a black heart, so... Conquest, how I hate you. 
couple of reasons. One, he's a jerk. Two, that attack is 100% random and uh, impossible to react to. So, you know, that's why he does it two times in a row. Also, he's invulnerable for a time when he's off screen. Thank you, Infamy. Something great. Empty Vessel is great. It gives us... It gives us flying. And, um... A shield. A random shield. Pick up the pony just so we never see it again. And the flying will let us get into that curse room for free. And then we can use... Um... Not the curse room. Ooh, what's the black card in here? Oh, hello. I want the range down. Um... Flying will make it so we don't have to take damage going to this curse room. Crack this open. Um, undefined to get out of it. Sure, take a steam sail. Take, hit another undefined. Takes us to the secret room again. And... I mean, we got one more. Oh, that took us to the black market. There's a bunch of things we can't get, but at least there's a convenient way down to the next floor. Um, yeah, I don't want any of that. Next floor, please. I didn't... I forgot the black market was on the list of places you could go. Let's take a look at the map. Definitely up and to the right. Spikes, Chief. I don't think we've seen a golden chest all run, and they're, like, one of the best parts about being Kane. Is that he opens golden chests for free. Because he has the lockpick. Alright, we have to beat Mom's Heart in 30 minutes. We may have dallied too long. On previous floors here. We gotta get... But... We could be okay. A minute and a half, I think we're gonna be okay. <coughs> to get the hush. Alright, just buckle up. Fire away. Ooh, we got that shield. Get in there. Yeah, like a seven second shield from uh empty vessel. Ooh. Give it to me this way. Thank you. And we're in there. We're in there. I don't want to go to Undefined here, so. Or um the I am error room. I should say. Hey, there's those golden chests I was hoping for. Um, yeah, glad, glad I grabbed that steam sail, too. Let's crack these open before we start picking up stuff. Ugh. That's... I don't remember. That is, as long as you fire the same direction, your rate of fire increases. And that is you shoot these eyeballs that also shoot... I don't remember the names of them. Tiny Planet. Well, we're not taking Tiny Planet. <laughs> Let me put it to you like this. We're not taking Tiny Planet. Ooh, Justice. Justice. Um, I mean, might as well here. Let's buy it all. Um... I'm going to go with this one, uh, Epiphora. It only works while you're in combat, but you'll notice as I'm firing, you can hear the rate of fire increase. Yeah, look at that. So as long as we keep shooting the same direction, the other item, ooh, infamy, saving lives. So we just keep firing to the right. We always stay to the left of the hush. Oh wow, and the uh, the little bit um, dropped a black heart for us. So make sure we get that before the room is over. Perfect. Let's get in here. Come on, fart baby. It's 
so our rate of fire has capped, which is what. Pretty fly. Pretty fly caught that one. Which is why our, uh, our rate of fire is not increasing. There is a cap. Uh, I think we can go higher if we reduce our tier delay through something like. Oh, oh we have the shield. Get in there. Oh, it's about to fade. Um, Where's our tear delay with, like, the uh, cancer trinket? <laughs> Not the cancer item. Cancer item. Oh, yeah, we're going to get a bunch of black hearts out of these guys. No! All right, we have to turn around. Which, see, makes our rate of fire all sad and slow. Jeez, that is a ton of black hearts. Serpent Kiss was great. Alright, trick for gravity. It's anti. or, um. What are these tiers called? Get an item that does this. But anyway, the trick is don't move. You just stay in a place where they don't hit you, and then just don't move. So we're pumping max rate of fire into Hush right now. Things are looking up. Oh, God. Those flies came a little close. Huh. Yeah, and about an Isaac length away from him in any direction. Uh... From the dead center of him. Ooh, tends to be safe for those. Um, shit. That's alright, we got it right back. Alright, we have to turn and reset our rate of fire, but that's okay. We'll just build the machine gun back up here. Come on, man, pop up. There he goes. Oh, we got the shield. Get in there. Did it. Uh, I would like to use. Oh. I'd like to use Undefined. Alright, I'd like to buy a battery and use Undefined again. There it is. Look at this. I'll take that. And we're going to roll this. It is not changing. I don't want the tractor beam, please. Or the... Yeah. Does it not re-roll? Let's blow it up. Blow it up. Blowing up guarantees a re-roll. Oh well, I guess we're taking it. There's a tractor beam. Now, this should still take us to the cathedral, if I'm not mistaken. Took us down. That's fine. Um, because we're only going to the cathedral anyway. And a, ch and a chest isn't going to spawn, because... We're not on a floor that we're supposed to be on. So, um, what we need to do is now all time restrictions have been lifted. Uh, if you don't, know what the, if you can't tell what the tractor beam does, your tears always stay in the beam. So, I can swing tears into things. Bah. Um. So I'm gonna hunt this entire floor, looking for. A, um, a sacrifice room. And then we're gonna sacrifice. And, uh, nope. Try to get to the, um, to the dark room. The dark room was always the ultimate goal anyway. It's just we had to get there via sacrifice, so... I don't believe... We might be able to get undefined here. I'm... We're gonna pop this on cooldown. Or pop undefined on cooldown. Um, just because if we do get undefined, it will send us. I believe it'll send us to the dark room. On the dark room or the chest, you can't get an I am error room anymore. Um, in just rebirth, uh, not the afterbirth. 
DLC. Um, when you, uh, if you got an I am air room on the chest or the dark room, when you there'd be a beam of light there or a hole in the ground, and when you walked into it, it would uh, basically just reset. Take you back to the beginning of the, uh, the dark room or the chest, whatever you're on. Basically reset it for you. So, okay, there we go. I don't know why I flew around those rocks. Didn't have to do that. So, we're, we're on the hunt. Ooh. Ooh, that was very dumb. We're going to take these fires out real fast. Alright, one super greed down. Two super greed down. I'll take the quarter. Um, regardless, we're going to clear out everything because that's more exploration bonus. This is unfortunately not a sacrifice room. It's just a room with some spikes in the middle. <laughs> Don't be fooled. Accept no imitations. See what we got in here. Yeah, might as well. Yeah, might as well. Eh, yeah, might as well. Wheel of Fortune. I should probably be leaving these black hearts on the ground, and I am going to leave... Well, I don't think I can pick any more up now, but... I'm not going to pick any more up, just in case uh, we need them for playing the self-sacrifice room. Wheel of Fortune. I haven't been using this on cooldown, have I? We just got a battery. So. Let's try that. Damn, secret room. Eh, oh. Let's just uh, keep going. I don't think. We want to change trinkets. Where'd he, where'd he go? God, I hate wizards. Which is the name of this enemy. Oh, just drop that on the ground. Lovers doesn't help us out too much. <laughs> Alright, Loki. This is, we fought a lot of Lokis on this run. Damn it. Hey, we found it. Alright, let's uh, clear out a little bit left. I would like to try for the I am air room one more time. That's what it looks like we're going to get. One more chance at it. Fear, fear makes uh, enemies jump weird. So, gotta be on the, the lookout for that. Let's go! Damn it. <laughs> oh well. Nice. He can't do anything because he's over the rocks. He knows his shots will get blocked, so he's trying to move out of the way, but he wants to move out of the way towards me, and he can't because I was shooting him. I'm knocking him back. Right, we got the sun. The sun. Yeah, it's not going to do anything for us, so. It's normally map, compass, and full health, but um, we already have the map. We've been to pretty much every room, so I don't need the compass anymore. And uh, it's full red hearts. <clears throat> Refills all your red hearts, and we don't have any of those, so. Alright, here we go. Playing the, uh... Oh, we're gonna get that shield every time. Alright, so we bump and leave. 
to make it just iframes. So, so far, you haven't received any reward. Okay. At this point, might as well just stay. Alright, a couple of pennies. I believe this is going to be troll bombs. No, it teleported me to the deal with the angel, which has soul. I will take it. I will not pull up the angel statue because we're about to fight the angel. Nice. Thanks for the uh, one heart. Thank this is the troll bombs, right? There we go. Thankfully, I am immune. Angel fight. Thank you. Thank you for doing the one that lets me kill you. Pick that up. We're going to leave and come back to get rid of the pedestal. Alright, well, we were a little unlucky in that we got the 30 cents instead of the 7 spirit hearts, but because of our uh, poisoning things, there are spirit hearts all over the place. Yeah, angels, even though they can fly, they just still bump into those spikes. So you can uh, circle them spikes <laughs> and make them real sad. Alright, now we, we're going to go grab every black heart we can. Uh, and the reason is the next reward we get is going to be a teleport. So we want to make sure we don't leave anything behind that we want. Uh, let's check in here. Just, okay. All right. Hopefully first play will send us. It did. Sweet. So now we're in the dark room. Unfor I, I got the key just for fun because you. Mm, hello. Um, actually, it's pretty okay that we got that. The fool. I, I don't know. I think you just can't go to the I am air room. I think this is just like a random teleport. But no, don't waste yourselves on that. Use it, I guess. Hi, right, super greed. Nice. Uh, we'll go, go left. Clear this out for X. That's right. Can't be below him. Below him, he gets all brimmy. Nice. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll take Black Bean. Black Bean's a helper. I thought I could kill him before. Or that my shots would push him away. Wrong on both counts. I don't think he's going to have a chance to brim. He didn't. Double the K gate. Double the gate. So, yeah, once we get. Uh, that's supposed to bend to the uh, the jumpers here, but since the jumpers all died, nothing for it to bend to. Let's get this brownie out of the way. Nice, nice amount of health that we're getting. Seeker room again. Right. All in all, I'd say this runs pretty good. I mean, we've taken a way more damage than we should have, for sure. But our health is still fine. I might take that into the um, into the boss. If we don't get a better option. There we go. Who am I kidding? I'm not going to backtrack all the way for that thing. It's not good enough. Bottom line. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, yeah, getting hit resets um, my epiphoria. Sad but true. Alright. In Wizards. God, I hate them. There we 
go. Oh, we're at 99 cents. That's something. I should have chosen a different direction to shoot. Now I feel committed. Continue shooting downward. We get one of them. There we go. Yeah, I just turn. <laughs> Don't make this a nightmare. For no reason. Hey, hey another item. Triple shot. Sure. Oh my god, that's right, all the tears are grouped up in the tractor beam. It's like this weird pulse shot thing going on. But also, the longer that I fire this direction, the faster it's going to go. So what? what's the, uh, the theoretical max here? Not too bad. If we get a, uh, if we get another needle, we'll have the, uh, we'll get the transformation, which gives us, um, plus two damage. That'll be real nice. I think it's, I don't remember what the name of that transformation is. Well, if we see it, oh, we get the name. Alright. Unfortunately, the black cards are drying up. Whoa. Boom. No real interest. Let's see if we can keep firing left. Hey, there's a black heart. Thank you. Damn it. Are those wide shots? Yeah. Pupula duplex. Not a real thing, turns out. Or at least there's no reported cases of it ever. An eye with two pupils. I don't think. I believe I looked at uh, when this game like first released. I'm like, is that a real thing? Oh, I want to see an eye that looks like that. And it was just like, oh, it's a made-up thing. I could be wrong. It could be totally real. Bam. Hey! Continuum! As soon as I saw it, I knew it was called Continuum Shots. Yeah, so if we do this... Hello? No? Our shots don't come back around? Oh, because of the damn tractor beam. That sucks, continuum and the tractor beam doesn't work. Oh well. Eh, hit this one more time. Of course, it's secret room. I just think you can't get to the eye of air room anymore from... from here. Sure, I'll take the eternal heart. Alright, boss. gonna fire this way and as soon as he gets close to doing something we don't like yeah, that's something we don't like so I don't think it's gonna take us another 30 seconds to beat this boss it did not we did it <laughs> 357 Ugh, not very good but we did get, I mean, look at the damage penalty. The damage penalty almost completely negated our rush bonus. I'm still, I'm still pretty happy with that. Um, I kind of wish we broke 40. But again, that's, that's uh, my fault with the damage penalty there. 
Um, just took <clears throat> took way more damage than I should have. So that's how it goes sometimes. And uh, all right, there we are. So all right. So if you're having a good time tonight. Uh, I encourage you to follow so you know if I will go live again. What am I doing? I just went straight into it. I'm gonna take my first. <laughs> I'm gonna take my first break of the evening. Let's let's uh, do it that way. And uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure what I'm gonna be playing when I come back. Uh, I think with the the Isaac Daly out of the way, um, yeah, I'm, I don't know. I'm gonna take a minute to think about it. I'm not 100 percent sure. Uh, what I want to play so um, I guess we'll just figure it out when we return so if you're having a good time tonight I encourage you to follow so you know if I go live again if you're watching this replay on YouTube I encourage you to subscribe so you know if I have new videos are posted just find me on Facebook and Twitter right up there and we'll be right back after it's very brief break